Hi, my name is Adam Pfeffer. I'm an agronomic systems manager with Bear Crop Science. I'm here standing in a plot of our new soy, new soybean trait uh, coming to market, expected with registration soon, Extend Flex Soybeans. Um, this new soybean trait, part of the Roundup Ready Extend crop system, is going to provide Canadian growers with three modes of action for herbicide tolerance. Um, built on our Roundup Ready 2 Extend platform, Extend Flex Soybeans brings additional tolerance to glufosinates uh, in addition to glyphosate and dicamba that we have today with our Roundup Ready Extend crop system. So here in our weed control demo at our Chatham Research Farm, you can see uh, the untreated check here on my right hand side and, uh, and our first treatment, weed control treatment here on my left hand side. You can see uh, in this conventional till soybean block, um, you know, we're mid July here. These beans were planted late May and then uh, didn't receive a whole lot of rainfall to get chemistry activated or weeds to germinate until later on um, in the growing season. But you can see a pretty nice population of red root pigweed. Uh, there is the odd lambs quarters in this, uh, in this weed control demonstration as well. Um, but pretty decent broadleaf weed control pressure or weed pressure. And on my left hand side here, uh, this first treatment is Roundup Extend at the five liter per hectare rate, uh, followed by just Roundup in crop. So again, utilizing that foundation weed control program that we have in our Roundup Ready Extend crop system of that high rate Roundup Extend uh, in that pre-emerge uh, window and then coming back in uh, with Roundup in crop. So the next two treatments here in our weed control demonstration, the plot here on my right is uh, again, that same Roundup Extend high rate treatment, five liters per hectare or two liters per acre pre. And then we came back in about two weeks ago with an application of Liberty uh, 200 SN. And you can see on this pigweed here, pretty classic Liberty symptomology. Um, you know, quick burn, it was done on a hot, humid day kind of ideal timing from a liberty standpoint. And you can see pretty decent control. Uh, there's a few misses here uh, in the first plot, but as you move further back, it is very clean. So again, giving growers to utilize other modes of action uh, in crop um, other than just Roundup. So again, Roundup Extend Pre followed by an early in crop application of Liberty uh, in crop. And the plot here on my left is a three pass system. So we went in with Roundup Extend Pre uh, to give us that short-term broadleaf residual control. We came back in around that third trifoliate stage with additional pass of Roundup to clean up any uh, grasses or anything else that might have flushed after that pre-emerge treatment. And then we came in with that same uh, Liberty uh, application uh, late post-emerge, so just up above or just before uh, that R1 stage. So you can see a very clean plot um, again Adding in that additional Liberty uh, application later in the season uh, gives us another look, gives wheats another look at a different chemistry and, uh, and gives us more flexibility uh, in the crop systems. Thank you and uh, have a good day.